Good morning, everybody. It's uh, good to see you again, even though we are at a distance, as is our norm at the minute. Uh, blessings to each of you and uh, thoughts and love and prayer for all of you. Uh, this morning I was uh, reading scriptures and I read Psalm 24 and I'd like to read that to you. It was a bit of an encouragement. It also made me chuckle. So let me just read this to you. Psalm 24. The earth is the Lord's and all that is in it, the world and those who live in it. For he has founded it on the seas and established it on the rivers. Who shall ascend the hill of the Lord and who shall stand in his holy place? Those who have clean hands and pure hearts, who do not lift up their souls to what is false and do not swear deceitfully. They will receive blessings from the Lord and vindication from the God of their salvation. Such is the company of those who seek him, who seek the face of the God of Jacob. Lift up your heads, O gates, and be lifted up, O ancient doors, that the King of glory may come in. Who is the King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty, the Lord mighty in battle. Lift up your heads, O gates, and be lifted up, O ancient doors, that the King of glory might come in. Who is this King of glory? The Lord of hosts. He is the King of glory. Amen. What an encouraging scripture, but it made me laugh because of that. Uh, those who have clean hands and a pure heart. You know, in these times of uh, high hygiene levels and our worries about coronavirus, then and I just, just chuckled uh, in my soul. So I uh, hope you enjoyed that one as well. Uh, a few things just to share with you this morning that we can engage with. We've got some ideas and some things to do. Um, there is a 24-7, 60 minute prayer guide praying for the coronavirus pandemic. Um, it's a really good thing to do as family, as individuals. It's something to go through. Uh, there will be a link on our website to this. We're, we're starting a new resources page uh, where you can find resources and ideas and, and this will be linked on there. So please do have a look and use that. Um, there's also a, a COVID-19 prayers uh, these activities have been developed and used uh, to be used at home during this coronavirus pandemic. So again, please have a look at that one. And then something a little bit for, for all of us who um, enjoy a bit of creativeness, uh, enjoy doing something different. Um, a, a website called Illustrated Ministry have produced these colouring sheets, uh, a really good idea. And this one says, God calls me and it has a space there for us to answer. And it's a chance for us to reflect to look at scripture, to pray, uh, to colour, to be in the presence of God whilst we're doing this work and, and invite him to speak uh, into us. So does he call us into doing something? What does he call us? Does he call us his children? Those sorts of things. So something for us to engage in. Now, uh, particularly Illustrated Ministry are doing something interesting in that they are going to do a weekly resource that can be emailed to anybody if you want to sign up. So have a look on our website. The link will be on there and uh, we will be doing some other things. Just to notice as well, we're trying to do some worship material. Some of our worship team have written their own songs and uh, it would be good to include those. So on Saturdays, we will be doing uh, worship Saturdays and uh, we'll be doing our videos on there with our worship leaders and some of our team contributing to that. So watch out for this space. We're thinking of you, we're praying for you. Don't hesitate to get in contact if you need anything. Lots of love, God bless.